So, hello everyone. This is Ivan Franz Rosco. So, ladies and gentlemen, it is still 29th of June 2014 and it is now approximately 6 in the evening. So, let's continue with our co uh, coding bat batch. Okay, so, we finished the string 1 uh, section. Let's proceed with the next one. So, we proceed with RE1. So, how many problems is this set? So, we have 27 problems for this part. So, let's open the first 12 problems. Then, save our back file for this one. Okay, and clear our ID. So, let's proceed with the first problem. In an array of integers, return to if 6 appears in the first last element of the array. Array length will be 1 or more. Okay. Either first or last element. Next one, same first and last. Length, array length is one or more. Return through if. Oh. This is similar to the um, the previous problem. Return to if the R is length one or more. Okay. So it says in the plot. So if comes It's in the problem. It's in the specification rather. Okay. Got it. Next problem. Make pi. Return an integer array length 3 containing the first three digits. Okay. That is pretty much trivial. Could we return the array as yes. Problem. Come on and given two arrays and be returned to if they have the same first element, first element, or they have the same last element. Or, it's an or. Okay, come on and. Okay. Just 
Oh, okay. Um, like this one. Alright. So it's alright. Is it alright? Okay. Okay, got it. Next problem. Given an array of ints, length 3. Return the sum of its elements. So it's constant, it could be brute force. Rotate left three. Given any array ins of length three. So this is just okay. This is just similar to our previous uh, example. So one, two, three, two, three, one. So two, three, one. So that's length of one, two, one, two, and zero. One. Reverse three. Okay. Same. It's the same. Similar, rather. Okay. Similar. Oh, uh, not, not, not this one. This one. So it's just two one zero. Okay, that's correct. Next one. Next problem. Max entry. <coughs> Given an arbitrary entry, figure out which is larger between the first and last elements in the array. Set all the elements to that value. Re return the changed array. Okay. So this is similar to uh, just so let's have a function here. Oh it's double. Let's just have a variable. Larger one, right? Seems to be a problem here. Next 
Sum two. Return the sum of the first two elements. Arrays and bib each length to return the new array of length 2 containing their middle. problem next problem make ends containing the first and last elements will be of length one or more First and last. Did we answer the exact problem in the previous ones? Given an array with the if it contains a two or a two.
was curious what's the difference between a star and a, uh, a check and a star uh, other than a check because in the previous one make ends I, I guess this is the optimal solution but I just got to check but anyway so that ends the first 12 problems let's proceed with the next 12 two, one, two, three. One, two, three, and one, two, three. Um, let's check. Yep. Twelve problems. Okay, next problem. If it does not contain a two or a three, does not contain. So this is uh, this is the opposite, right? Okay, given an array, return the new array double blank. In Java, is the array interest double blank. Okay. one double zero given an int array return true if the array contains two twice or three twice array the array will be of length zero one or two two twice or three twice Then, so, hmm, hmm, okay. Hmm. Wait, it's return. 
to be a gang and there's zero one or two. This is or why? <laughs> Oh, it's less than two. Okay, it should be less than two. It should be less than two. Okay. It should be less than two. Okay. Okay, got it. Next, double two three. Fix two three. Given an int array length 3, if there is a 2 in an array immediately followed by a 3, set the 3 element to 0. There are only 2 cases. Uh, So then, uh, okay. Uh, so this. Oh, okay. Nums of zero, nums of one. Right? So, uh, nums of zero, nums of one. Two zero. So, right here. Got it. Oh, it's too soon. Start one. Okay. Given two arrays of any length. Okay, got it. Next one, bigger two. Given two arrays A and B, each of length two. Consider the sum of the values of each array. Return the array that has the largest sum. In an event of a tie, return it. Each of them is 
Oh, it's easy. You can hard code it, right? Turn A. Ah, uh, okay. A. B is greater than A. Ah, uh, yes. B is greater than S. A. Wait, just put that next. Ah, uh, put that on B. Put that on A. I'll just pause for a while. So let's continue. Okay, so what's the problem again? Make middle. Where will make middle? We go to. So let's proceed with the next problem. Make middle. Okay. Given the two ends of even length, return a new array length to containing the middle two elements of the original array. The original array will be length two or more. I guess we solved the problem using strings last time, right? So if it's uh if the nums array is four, we have to return um one and two, right? So it should be nums length and nums of length divided by two. Uh, just to be sure. Let's reload again. The internet is too slow. Or, um, okay, next. Plus 2. Given 2 int arrays, each blank 2, return a new array 4 containing all of them. So this is just a merge. Uh, We back up next time. We back it up. Okay. Okay. So this is a of zero. We just do it by brute force, I guess. Okay. Next one. Okay, next one. Swap ends. So given an arb in swap the first and last. Array length will be at least one. Okay. Um, okay. Uh, so we have a.
open it. Mid three, okay. Add length will be at least three. Okay. So I'll do it. I guess we fix up this one. These strings, right? So if num is five, it should be one, two, and three. Seven should be two, three, and four. So this should be nums, 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 nums divided by two. This one. This is nums divided by two. Ah, okay, nums of nums divided by two. This is nums of nums divided by two. Formula correct. Nums that uh, length rather. Given an array of add in length with a length at least one, look at the first list in the middle values and return the next array. That will be at least one. Largest. Okay. This is an array of element. If there, if the given array is of element three, we should return. Okay, so nums of nums. I just like to add the same to the previous one. This is equal to nums of nums that length. Correct. Front piece. Given an int array of any length, return the new array of of its first two elements. That's all there. Okay, so we finish the next 12 section, the second section of the 
Torx RE1. Uh, let's check. Okay, so we've solved 24 problems. So let's do the last three problems. Okay, he'll say that one immediately followed by a three is called an unlucky one. Return two. And the first two and last two First two, last two. Sick of the one. It's an or. or. Okay. Minus one, minus two, minus three. Okay. solution go Five zero one two.
So do we delete this? It says here last two positions. Elements followed by that. the air one
correct? So we should have twenty seven. Um matrix. Okay. So this is the end for the RE1 section. So see you on the next video for the next batch of problems. So thank you for watching.